Since the beginning of time, we have been searching for a deeper understanding of our experience and our existence. Civilizations have risen and fallen, leaving behind traces of wisdom. Are there clues in these traces that can help us unite this ancient wisdom with today's cutting-edge scientific research? Can we view nature in a more holistic way that will solve many of the major problems facing our world today? Are you ready for crossing the event horizon? Maybe instead of looking for a fundamental particle, we should start looking for a fundamental principle of division. We should start looking for a fundamental pattern of creation. Because if we understand the pattern, we understand the principle behind the identity. Now we have the key to creation. The key to universal forces. I found eventually that the key was geometry. In a boundary is the possibility of infinite division. And thus, infinities and finite structures are complementary. If our universe is expanding, then there must be something contracting, there must be some compression happening in order to get expansion. There must be a feedback between the expansion and the contraction. And the fact that we could start to see the information feedback loop between the radiated side and the contracted side starts to open a whole new field of physics. So basically Einstein said, Gravity is the result of space-time curving like the surface of a trampoline. What we say in this paper, yes, and when space-time curves, it doesn't just curve, but it curls, just like water going down the drain, and that generates spin. And that's the source of the spin of all things. Now when you look in nature, you can see these dynamics. Taking these principles and applying them to yourself, you could start to visualize, you could start to imagine, you could start to experience that maybe within the confine of the finite structure that you're in is the potential of infinite division the potential of infinite amount of information. You're transferring that information through your boundary to the infinite of the universe within yourself. Everything we see in the universe is just division of that energy density of the vacuum in various scales. The biological resolution is the link between the large and the small. You are the event horizon. Instead of seeing yourself as an insignificant little dot that means nothing to the universe, you start to see yourself as the center of creation. Everyone else is the center of their universe as well. And thus, we are all equal and we're all one.